Now, no, and some students in the Philadelphia School District will officially return to class under the hybrid plan. The district, along with city and union officials, announced a new date today. And after a weeks long back and forth, there was just a sigh of relief from really all parties involved. Our Jeff Cole joins us live with the details. What can you tell us, Jeff? Well, Shana, we know that in suburban school districts, kids have been back in classes on a hybrid model for some time now. In fact, some of these districts are going to bring back their kids three or four days a week. Philadelphia kids in public schools have not been back since last March. It looks like a week from today, the youngest kids will return. Well, for the reopening of our Philadelphia public schools. Gathered in the Wright Elementary School in Strawberry Mansion City and school district leadership, socially distanced nearby the heads of the teachers union, both sides seemingly aware of how they dodged a bullet. I particularly want to thank the mayor and, um, and Superintendent Height because this could have gone really badly for a very long time. Instead, 2,620 public school students, pre-K through second grade, will return to 53 schools next Monday. Both sides agree are safe. It's an achingly long year, Jeff. It's been a horrible year for everybody. We've had over 3,000 deaths in the city. I mean, so, you know, we are, we are all people of goodwill looking to work this out. The 13,000 member Philadelphia Federation of Teachers has been at odds with the district. After Superintendent William Height told teachers to return in early February or face disciplinary action, the union, arguing the aging schools were not safe during a pandemic, advised its members to stay home. Two dates to reopen schools were canceled while a mediator assessed building safety leading to today's agreement. I'm not the king, and, and so me declaring all schools are safe doesn't, does it, doesn't make everybody else feel like that. Every week until March 22nd, the district says it will announce batches of schools to open with a goal of returning 9,000 children. Gone are those controversial window fans remaining, says the union, inequality. It's a fight that is rooted in systemic racism that for far too long has been, sh has been shortchanging our students, a majority of whom are black and brown, and a majority of whom are experiencing great levels of poverty. So the parents of some 9,000 students pre-K through second grade want their kids to return to school, and over the month of March, they will slowly be brought back to 53 schools, says the school district of Philadelphia and its teachers' union. As for the other kids, unclear exactly if or when they will return. Here in Strawberry Mansion, I'm Jeff Cole, Fox 29.